Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to create a custom paper size in any Epson printer. It is a very easy and simple process. And before go to this video, if you not subscribe this channel, then subscribe this channel and also click on the bell icon. I give two methods because Epson printers use two different types of the software interface and if first method is not work, then go to the our second method. So let's go to the our video. First, we go to the our first printer, go to the start, and I type printers and scanners, type printers and scanners, click on the printers and scanners. In a printers and scanners, here we find our all install printer. Here we find our all install printers. Select the printer that you want to change a printing preferences or uh, create a new paper size. So I click on this Epson SC. P7000 series printer first I click on that printer click on the your print Epson printer here we find printing preferences click on the printing preferences here we find the, our printing preferences I center it and here we find many options and main option for us is paper settings here we find source and size here we find the source rare paper feeder you can click on the any paper feeder feeder that you want I go to the here size here we find size click at here here we find many options okay you can select any option from here or you can choose user defined or the custom paper size also click on here or if click on click at here or click on user defined click on user defined and here we find the user defined options here we find many options first we change the name you can give any name that you want I give the name of the my paper size you can give any name test or any name that you want I give the 7 by 10 okay I give the 7 by 10 okay you can give any name and if you want to enable borderless printing then click at here I don't want and if you want to fix accepted show printing then click at here and select 1 by 1 16 by 9 3.1 any any size that you want I go with the no specification and here we find paper width and paper height and it is in inches if you want to in millimeters then go with the mm i go with the inches so i select inches and always width width is on the smaller side and the height is in the always higher sides i want to and here we find the maximum uh, minimum and maximum width and here we find the minimum and maximum width that you queue to the your paper size so i go to the here and i queue the c1 uh, not c1 i give the 9 by 13 so i type 9 9 is the my smaller size and 13 is the my higher side and i select inches and after that save save is more imp save your paper size give any paper size name name is also important give the name and click on the save and after that click on the ok after that here we find sizes and click on this size and go with the user defined or go with the your size that you created i go with the 7 by 10 okay and then click on the apply click on the okay and your size is changed to your custom paper size next option is if this is not work for you and this is not inter software interface for the your printer then next option is I go to the next printer i click on the start and type printers and scanners once again click on the printers and scanners in a printers and scanners select the your printer that you want here we find the defined printer or the install printers select the your Epson printer this is the my printer i click on the printing preferences scroll down and find printing preferences click on the printing preferences so minimize it center it here we find another method or the another type of the interface here we find main option is document size and we are going to the here more options and here we also find the document size and output paper size make sure output paper size same as the document size same as the document size and go to the main go to the main tab click on this document size it is something like a4 or any other then go to the here user defined click on the user defined and new option is pop up you can give any name i give the my sizes or the my printing size my printing 
you can give any name and same thing with the same printer width is always to the smaller side and height is always to the higher side i go with the inches you can give, go with the mm also i give the same one by 10 you can give any size i give the same one by 10 and inches paper size is paper size name is also imp click on the save click on the apply here we find our paper size and click on the ok now go to the document size select your size that you create create click on your size and after that go to the more options go with the size that you want and most imps output paper size go with the your size or go with the same as the document size same as the document size is also apply click on the apply click on the ok and that's all you create a custom paper sizes or the size in an Epson printer so guys this is the simplest way to create a custom paper size in, a, in any Epson printer so guys thank you for watching this video don't forget to like share comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you guys